Hi everyone, I'm Charity Gashenga and thank you for tuning in to another episode with me. People ask me all the time, how do I maintain my level of self-confidence and how am I always able to be so happy and joyful? And what I can say is that I have been through a lot like most people. The only difference is how I responded to the things that I went through. There are always those things you can't change, those things you had no involvement in but still affected you, and those things you did yourself that you could have completely avoided. And what I choose to do with all of those different obstacles is not blame myself and recognize that life is not perfect. I'm expected to make mistakes, but I have to learn from them. As long as I've learned from my mistakes, I have a apologize for my mistakes and forgiven myself for them, then I feel happy. I feel confident because I know I am a better person. When you start to feel insecure or discouraged or lack confidence, it's because you are not proud of what you've been through in life and you have not allowed the mistakes you've made to build your character. So just take time to sit back and really see what you've been through and why that makes you special. Why does that make you stand out among your peers, among your colleagues, among your competitors? And that's exactly what's gonna fuel you to continue to be more of who you need to be and less of what the world is trying to make you be. People put us in a bubble, but did you know we put ourselves in a square? In this little square, expecting to get out, expecting to see what the world is about and to achieve new things, but there's no door in that square. So whether the world is keeping you in a circle or if you're keeping yourself in a square, you should never let yourself be boxed into anything. You always have another day to be a better person, to make better accomplishments in life and to make a bigger impact. So as long as you wake up and you're living and breathing, you need to be happy because yesterday's failures are not yours to worry about. You have today. And don't you dare worry about tomorrow because tomorrow is not even yet to come. So just focus on the now, live in the moment, surround yourself with the correct people who are going to make sure that you are walking in your truth, that you are who you need to be and that you are the best version of yourself and practice being the best version of yourself with people who genuinely deserve it and not with those who don't even know who you are to begin with to even know when you're being your best. So for me, I've created a really small circle of people who have seen me go through my journey and transformation of becoming more mature, more confident, and more self-aware of who I am. And I really allow those people to critique me with love. You hear that? Critique me with love because I don't always like hearing about myself. But when these people tell me, Charity, I see you're lacking in here. Charity, you can do better in here. Charity, I'm really disappointed. It makes me feel like I need to listen to them because they have my best interest in mind and they don't want anything but to see me win. So have a winning circle, people you support in that same manner and also those who support you in that same manner. Thank you so much for tuning in. I cannot wait to talk to you guys again. Make sure you leave some comments below. Make sure you subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook at Charity Gashenge. Until next time, I can't wait to see you.